Hello, Taurus, and welcome to Taurus Truth Tarot, where we are all Taurus all the time. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and North Node. We are going to get our message from Spirit today. Uh, my name is Shannon Colleen. I am a Taurus Sun and Venus. Took me a second to remember there. <laughs> so before we get started, just want to give you all a reminder that, yes, I am available for personal readings and personal Reiki sessions. There's a link in the description box below, and uh, it will take you to my calendar. My calendar does say Lotus Spirit Tarot. That is my company name. That's my other channel, so you'll you'll be in the right place. And for those of you who have gotten readings of Reiki, please put it in the comments. Let them know. Let people know, right? Oof. All right. Divine Source Creator, what is the overall energy, please? Show us clearly what is the overall energy. Oh, wow. Yep. <clears throat> I knew it. I could have called this. <laughs> I could have called this. So you have aura here. It says observation. So today is going to be a day of silence, if you will. Um, have your protective bubble around you, right? Your aura goes out about six feet. And I just feel like whatever comes up today, do not run to reaction, Okay, it's kind of like they're giving me the feeling like if you give somebody enough rope, they'll hang themselves kind of feeling. So whatever might be going on that is not going in the direction that you would like, you need to stay still. Okay, you need to stay still. Okay, <laughs> so don't make any rash decisions. Don't make any reactions. Don't react to anything. Stay centered. Stay in your heart space. And let it play out, okay? So I'm not saying anything bad is going to happen. I'm just saying don't get involved, right? Even if it directly involves you, do not get involved, okay? That happened to me uh, at a workplace years and years ago where I had a... There's times to speak up and there's times not to speak up. And I had a horrible boss. I'm sure we all have had horrible bosses. And I just laid back. I just laid back, did my job, you know, put my head down and did what I had to do. And sure enough, uh, with some time, that person got fired. Okay, that person got fired. So whatever situation this is for you, also be careful too uh, if you are, if you have children or you have, uh, you know, a, a partner, you're in love, you got a partner, you're married, whatever it might be. If they come at you, I will tell you right now, because I keep saying this emperor down here, it's not you, okay? It's not you. They might come at you, right? They might say something not so nice. They might do that. Don't react to it, okay? Do not react to it, because I promise you, it's not you. There's something else going on. But I would also say, don't be intrusive either. I, it's not time to be a therapist, right? It's not a time to go in and say, I know you're not angry at me. What are you angry at? Nope. You just need to sit back today. All right. Lots of new beginnings. I kept seeing, I don't know about you guys, the Ace of Pentacles. I saw another Ace. I can't remember. Ace of Wands maybe as I'm shuffling. Um, holy crap. Ace of Swords. Wow. Yeah, you guys <laughs> sit back and wait. This is a time where Taurus patience does pay off in a big way, okay? I am telling you, something good comes out of you observing, okay? Something really good comes out for you by observing. So, whew, let's see what we have. Yep, something's ending, something's beginning, right? That is a good thing, okay? So there's a lot of different scenarios this can play out in Taurus because you're all going through different things. It's not going to be the same for all of you. But this could be somebody getting fired, you getting a promotion. This could be, you know, your partner is just, you know, letting you have it for whatever reason. And then a day later, they come and apologize and they, you know, you have a fresh start. They bring you flowers, whatever, right? But there is death to something here, which needs to, which needs to die. Okay, which needs to die. It needs to go away. It needs to be done over. There's a brand new shiny path opening up here. Show me clearly. <laughs> yeah, ooh, yeah, okay. Yeah, someone is really going to get it. <laughs> and I don't mean you guys. 
All right. So for example, this is just one example. Let's say your partner does come home from work and they are really pissed off because of X, Y, Z reason, right? And they're taking it out on you. Um, it's because they're feeling left out in the cold. Okay, it's because they're not doing so good. Your boss, the same thing, right? Not doing so good. They're in a different energy. This is not you guys. This is their energy, I'm telling you. The situation, the purpose. And the truth will come out. Okay, the truth will come out. You can see this Queen of Swords is sitting here. She's got her hand out, like I'm ready when you're ready, kind of thing, right? But she's not moving. She's in her throne. She is not up and she is not moving. She knows that this has nothing to do with her, right? So I would say for most of you, well, I can't say that. I can't put a percentage on it at this time. Some of the, you, this is like your children, your parent, your spouse, but a lot of you, it might be work related, <clears throat> right? But I am telling you, you be the queen of swords, okay? Don't have an opinion either way, right? I'm just going to sit and see what happens. Yes, look at that. I didn't know what the other card was, Hierophant. There we are. Knowing it's not us, being in our spiritual space, right? <laughs> We're just going to be in our spiritual space. We're going to let you guys do what you got to do. Um, that doesn't mean that you should be taking any sort of abuse. We're not talking about that, right? We are talking about someone uh, just being a real jerk, just being a real jerk in some way, whether that's a boss or, you know, like I said, a partner of some sort. But you hold your ground, okay? You hold your ground, and I promise you, you will be blessed for it, right? The Hierophant is blessings. You will be blessed for just sitting and observing and watching and seeing, right? I like that. That's very solid advice from Spirit. Show me clearly. Thank you. Yes. Oh, I love this Three of Wands. You, again, a lot of standing still. The Hierophant standing still. The Queen of Swords standing still, right? You're standing still. I like this. You're observing. He's looking out into the ocean, knowing, you know, good things are coming. Good things are coming out of this. I know that sounds crazy. You're like, how could it be? It, it, but again, I'll go back to, you know, the boss situation. Your boss is a real pain in your ass, right? And uh, because you do your work and you observe and you just kind of make your space, right? All of a sudden they get fired. You get offered their position. That's this type of energy, okay? Show me clearly for Taurus. What is the message for Taurus? Oh, that's too many. What is the message for Taurus here? Take the higher ground, right? Yes. Oh, my gosh. Look at, see? I told you. You will be satisfied with the outcome. You will be very, very thrilled with the outcome. What I say, put your head down, focus on you, your work. You know, don't react. Don't get in an argument. Don't, don't do that. It's like, this is not the time to do that. There are definitely times to stand up for yourself. We would have saw the seven of wands then, right? But this is like, mm -mm, the universe has it, okay? The universe has your back for this. And you will get something of a reward for not reacting, okay? So I, I beg of you, <laughs> if this comes up for you, or, you know, these are timeless. In the next few days, doesn't have to be necessarily, necessarily day it's aired. But within a few days, right, too, if anything like that comes up, Keep your mouth shut, okay? Keep your mouth shut. Keep your eyes on the prize, right, kind of thing. Eight of Pentacles, and you are going to come out ahead. You are going to come out ahead in this. All right, let's see what else we got. Let's see what we have. Show me clearly. I thought that was going to pop out, but it didn't. All right, show us clearly what is the message here. What is the message, please? Angels, guides, ancestors for Taurus. What is the message? Thank you. All right. This says here, morning rituals. I love this, right? Because this is observation, meditation. I love all of this. Morning rituals. In the mornings, I will take time 
to tune into myself, to set high vibrational rituals that will help me lead a good day. I I pay attention to the morning habits that don't serve me and change the the ones and change them for ones that do. See? If that if that wraps this up so beautifully, right? Like you just stay grounded, you stay, you've got your, you know, aura, you're good. I can't bur- burst my bubble. I'm not going to let you burst my bubble because when we react to that stuff, we're actually giving our power away, right? So, yes, oh my gosh, look at this. Thunder and lightning. This actually gives you power. Right? This quietness, this stillness, it's going to pay off for you. Okay? It is going to pay off for you. That was at the bottom of the deck. So, with that being said, all of my love, light, and blessings to you, Taurus. Until next time.